Hey everyone, welcome back to The Walking Dead. We will be starting episode 4 today, so let's just get right on into it. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea! You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Looks like this is our lucky day. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Don't want to yeah, jinx well, it. Well, the less I see, the happier I am. Where do you come down on staying or going? You mean, packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it, but have you made up your mind yet? We should go. We should go. The motel's run its course, Yeah. And it's not safe. you damn right it has. We pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water. And if Lily's dead set on staying, then, well, that's the way it goes. She can stay. But we're gonna leave, cause like, I don't trust that place anymore. We've been there okay, long yeah, enough. Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. Back at the pharmacy. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <sighs> You okay? The ladders come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. We can try it and see if it works. Well, or we Looks can... like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Better get a move on. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Okay. Well. Kenny, come on. Ah, uh, shit. Damn it. I can't reach. He didn't even try. Sorry, pal. All right, stay put. like it still works well then we should use it Lily's not doing so good huh well I mean well we killed her dad we did kill her dad
so I guess we just use that control thing. Yep. The girl's still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon? I think she understands. I think she understands. Hope so. Not like we had much choice. Right. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Uh, oh, shit! Well, that made a bit of noise. Let's ask if he's okay. Jesus. Are you okay? I'm fine. Shit. I'm sorry, pal. I thought it'd be healed up better. You're lucky it wasn't any worse. You could have. Well, that will definitely wake the walkers up. Help me! Somebody help me! Oh, God! Oh, God! What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Oh, too late. She's gone. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean. We leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. He has a point. Should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Okay, let's grab as much as we possibly can. There's this, the chocolate bar. She's gone. There's She's not gone. much time now. Alright. No stress, but uh... I don't see anything else, so let's just move on. I think that's everything! That There's one at the door. Okay, time to leave. Over. Still clear. Let's hustle. Oh, Jimmy, help! Are 
right, let's just leave it. Let's go, pal. And we're gone. So at least we got a lot of supplies. We got what was left anyways. some stickers in a drawer and I put them on my walkie hey sweet pea that's neat I'll find you in a minute looks like we got the kid on watch again what'd you get we might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone come and rape our women and children So, what did you get? A lot, a lot of, stuff. of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The We're winter? not staying. We'll freeze our asses off here! He's piling into an RV with you two. After what you did to my dad is so appealing. She can Why literally just stay here. You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because she of your dad's have health. To do anything. But he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly? Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lily. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you know What it. about medicine? We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always Was do. That and when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle choice? of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Okay. 
Well... Uh, let's... I... Okay, wait. Okay, let's talk to Clementine first. See how she's doing. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's, What's that you you're doing? working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Okay, well, I guess... Let's go up and see what Carly wants, because she said she wanted to talk to us. Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Um... I think about you too. We're gonna go there. Our group is small. You're small. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. Well, that escalated. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? We'll do I'll it. I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. I think it's best that we tell someone before Lily opens her mouth. Don't call me small. And tells everyone for us. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? We can ask if she feels safe here. Do you here. feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Yeah. You, uh... Have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Okay, well, we're going to tell Clementine, because, like, she's our main priority right now. We're going to tell Kenny, because, you know, we want him to know. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. Okay, let's before just be straight I met up. You in, before the plague, I killed somebody. Oh. I mean, she so already knows. that's what... Yeah, that's it. It was a bad thing, and there's no explaining it. Why are you telling me? I mean, she already knows that. I didn't that. want to keep it to myself anymore. Do you have any questions? You can go on back to your things. But didn't we tell her back at the pharmacy? She kind of already knew that we killed someone. Okay, let's talk to Kenny. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, it's but protection. I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Alright. 
Let's talk to Kenny. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? It's serious. Oh, no. What'd the she-devil do to you? Shut up, man. Let's just tell I him straight up. killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's. Different from everything. This was before the walkers. Uh... I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and... You know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, right? Yeah. yeah. I did. And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess has got us doing now, Lee. Shit. Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course. Then shut it. You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. Alright, well, those are the only two important people that I wanted to tell. So, like, here we go. I guess we can... Um, okay, let's talk to Lily and then I will end the video here. Because it's uh, I've already been filming for like 22 minutes. Don't want it to be a long video. I'm sorry. You oh, she apologized. To apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Hmm. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. And you came in here to confess? I'm the not white. stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. Okay, well don't point fingers or anything. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. Well, you Counts like... off and it's the good stuff. You need Antibiotics, proof. oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Okay, okay. I'll we'll poke around, around a little bit. Thank you. If you don't find anything, I'm just going to assume it's you. A mystery. Mm. Duck. Jesus, Duck. Of course he'd be listening. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. Let's be nice. Okay, you're Robin. Yes! What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird i'm on the case i used to i can't stand that kid but he kind of grows on me throughout the episodes well anyways i'm going to end it here i upload every day and I've been proud to say that I've been pretty consistent with that. The upload schedule that I'm aiming for is every day at like 2 p.m. Eastern. It's just, I'm testing that out to see how well it goes. But anyways, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next video.